Welcome to Where the Words Happen. I'm Ken Lawson. Today I thought I'd like to talk to you about the word of phrase, where the words happen, came from. Where the words happen can actually refer to any place where art is created. I said it best in the article, so here's the article I wrote. Writers of our reputation are supposed to be able to work anywhere. I suspect for the most part many of us are able to create content in any number of situations that would be, would be impossible to do in other types of creation. While doable is not ideal, true creation needs room to breathe, a space of its own to live. This is why the painter has the art studio, the movie maker has the sound stage and the editing room. These are spaces that allow them to create their best work. Some art requires its own space by its nature. Glass blowing, sculpture, especially large scale, those come to mind quickly. But there are many of other art forms that require their own specialized space and a place to create to be created properly. But what about the lowly wordsmith? Do we rate our own space? Recently I was able to acquire my own space. I call it my office. The difference that it has made in my peace of mind and work output has been enormous. Yes, there are days I come in and I just play on the computer and no real writing gets done. But on the other hand, I hope more and better stuff will get done. In the month or so that I've had the office, I've finished a major work in progress that involved going back and rewriting the POV point of view, writing a couple of short stories and some essays. So I'm getting stuff done. The other impact is peace of mind. Just having my own space to go to when I need when I need to is essential for my peace of mind. My office is not pretty. No furniture, no fancy furniture. It's pretty basic. A desk, a chair, a tower computer set up, a TV, a Roku, an entry level turntable. But I do have plans for the office. I know that getting the room exactly the way I want will take time, but that's okay. I have my own space, I have a place to write and relax. The bigger picture is that we all need our own own place to do our art. Be it writing, mixed media, leather work, everyone needs a space of their own. Be it to read a book or watch TV, listen to music, or just take a nap. If you're struggling to create in, le in a less than ideal space, chances are your work isn't the best that it can be. So if you get the chance to have your own space, grab it with enthusiasm. If not a room, but a corner, a desk, a small table, in a little in a little use room, take what you can get and make the most of it. We we can't all have our own room, such as my office or my arts or an art studio, but we do the best we can to claim your own peace of mind. This series of videos. It's called Word, Where the Words Happen because it's focused on the art and craft of writing and the writing life. I hope you enjoyed this edition of Where the Words Happen. And be sure to subscribe and like the video and, and feel free to leave a comment down below. Where does your art happen? Do you have your own space to create? Drop us a line and tell us what you create and where. And I'm Ken Lawson. Thank you for watching Where the Words Happen. <laughs>